what's going on guys, Vengeance914 here, in today's video we're going to be going over nest tracking and biopsy. We aren't playing Tachanka, we maxed him out, I just needed to change my attachments a bit after the last uh, guide that I made a moment ago. We're going to choose our next highest level operator regardless of what our objectives I is. Um, which is going to be Zofia. Um, I'm going to play with her guns a little bit, because even though I won't ever touch them, I still like having them ready. <laughs> So there. Now we're gonna go over here. No. I want the LMG for sure. Alright, all the gear is right. So I've mentioned what operators are good for nest tracking and biopsy, like Vigil is very good for nest tracking and biopsy, L is very good for biopsy, um, Pulse is good for nest tracking, etc. But this is just like you're playing a normal game, maybe you're under equipped, maybe you're new to the game, maybe uh, you don't have the right gear, maybe you're out of said gear, um, you know, you're just playing for XP or whatever. Okay. And we're gonna try to not use our drone. Normally you would use your drone, find your three objectives, get to the bottom of that mystery. map is a tough map to do nest tracking because there's a lot of open area. If I get in one of those blinding spores, it's over for me. So I have to go somewhere and blow it up. Or it'll blow up on me. And that will be... That'll alert literally everyone. When given no other choice, I took care of the... loader by shooting it in the leg a few times because I don't want to miss and blow it up and cause that issue and I also don't want to miss the chin weak spot a bunch of times and have him holler. Um, when you do complete the objective though, it is going to explode those three nests and those explosions will alert your targets. So. Be, sh be wary of that and switch locations before that goes off, similar to how I have. And now I'm just kind of shooting while I talk so that I can pass the time while I wrap this up. Um, some of the things that are going to not help at all is like Tachanka. Um, those types of sticking in one place and not gathering any information, it, uh, just like solely for damage, is going to be not a good choice for this particular objective. That's not to say it's a bad choice for another objective, but just like, keep in mind that you are not going to bring any utility to the table if you choose Tachanka and you have nest tracking. Keep let letting my mouse go and it just flies away. Yeah, eh, that's about all I have to say. There's not too much to go over here demonstrated how easy it can be. It can definitely get challenging. Um, a little note is that if you run out of nests, it will fail the objective. And if you haven't failed the objective, you have not run out of nests. No matter how much you want to give up because you keep getting spotted, and they keep you having you kill nests going. that you've alerted. Or someone in your game is killing nests with uh, just because they're stupid. Um, they, unless the objective has failed, you still have one to find and you still have hope. Even if you think it's not there, it is somewhere hidden in your map. It just might be a pain in the ass to get to. Um, otherwise, there's not too much else to say. Yeah. Hey, Jake here from the future. I bombed this outro, so I'm just going to record it again. I'm just going to tell you guys that I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like if you did, leave a dislike if you didn't, and have a good day, guys. Peace out.